When I was about eight, I just seen the film Titanic, um, and I, I really loved the, the song um, My Heart Will Go On. Um, and uh, we had a, a family reunion coming up, um, so I decided to sing for that. Um, so I suppose it was then that I knew that this was what I wanted to do. I live in quite a small village um, uh, near to Canterbury in Kent. Uh, I live on a, a non-working farm. Um, it's got like loads of woods surrounding it, uh, so it's uh, quite secluded. I was uh, 13, um, two days before the album came out, uh, on the 3rd of December. I just finished playing Oliver um, at my local theatre. Um, uh, Ron Moody, um, the Fagin from the film, came down to, to play Fagin again, um, which was really amazing. Um, and I, I heard of auditions for The Little Prince for the BBC. So uh, me and my mum went up to London to audition. So I auditioned uh, and actually managed to get the part. We filmed for about two weeks um, in, uh, in London. The record company, Sony BMG, um, they'd sent some people to watch me perform uh, and then decided to sign me. Um, and, and then uh, over the course of the spring, we um, put the album together. We went to Prague um, in the Czech Republic to record the orchestra with the, the uh, Prague Philharmonic Orchestra. Um, and uh, me and mum went along. The, the producer was Nick Patrick, who um, I'd met uh, during The Little Prince. Well, there's 13 tracks on the album. Uh, there's songs like P.A. Ezu. Um, there's Where Is Love, which uh, I sung on the BBC's Celebrating Oliver, um, which came out uh, last Boxing Day. Where is love? I chose a lot of the songs. Um, so, I mean, they're all songs that I really like uh, and that suit my voice. There's In Dreams from The Lord of the Rings, Walking in the Air from The Snowman. I mean, I think back to about a year ago, um, it was just school. Now, um, my weeks have got just really busy. Um, like, uh, I am kind of going to school like one day a week. I mean, I haven't really found it that difficult, actually. I just kind of ask my friends what I've missed, um, you know, ask what the homework was, and just really catch up. When we were doing the photo shoot for the album, we went down to Groombridge Park um, in Kent. Uh, it was like this really, really big, um, Manor House. Um, we spent two days um, just just filming. I mean, in my spare time, I like to you know, do my, my singing and stuff. But um, I'm also quite a sporty person. Um, like to play kind of football and tennis with my friends. When I'm not at school, um, me and my mum are just totally up in London, really, um, doing kind of uh, concerts and, and promotion, lots of photo shoots and interviews for lots of magazines. I do like to read in my spare time as well. I've just finished uh, all the Dan Brown books. One of my friends said that the Da Vinci Code was really good. Uh, I read that and was just kind of hooked. How can the light that burns so brightly suddenly burn so pale, brighter? I play the, the violin and piano. Um, but I've actually um, just started playing the guitar. My brother plays the violin. Um, he goes to the Purcell School in London, and uh, I thought it would be a really nice idea for him to play on the record. Um, so uh, he he played uh, on Where Is Love. Reaching into the night. Me and my brother have 
set up a little recording studio just downstairs. I've kind of been a really big fan of Robbie Williams all my life, um, but uh, I also really like um, Coldplay, um, James Blunt and Katie Melua. I do write my own songs. Well, I mean, lots of people have asked whether I want to go into pop. Um, I mean, the songs I write are mainly pop songs, but uh, I mean, anything can happen. I'm, I'm just going to wait and see, really.